technology has changed immensely since the new innovations with the massless systems because of no mass, of course. Um, ease of use with the new control box, the GX55. It's a pretty bulletproof system that we like a lot. The machine, it looks stock. You know, you've got a monitor in the cab, plug it in, let's go. Less things to break, less maintenance, and a way better performing machine. The main components of the uh, MAX system is your dual IMU. You know, one, one IMU is mounted a certain direction, it knows it's the blade sensor. The other one in the body, it's mounted in a certain orientation, it knows it's the body sensor. All the extra data we can throw in our machine builder now, we can tell our system to perform the way it probably always should have, but we haven't had that technology until now. On a public road, you have to be exact on what the engineer specifies, and the dozers uh, allow us to get our final product as exactly how they, they spec it out. When I first got this system, even my mom told me, she said, you're not as stressed, you know, and it's just because you're not all the time sitting wondering if you are got the right grade or, you know, if you if you went too deep or if you haven't went deep enough. It's so easy. It, it is easy, and it's something that everybody needs to look at because the accuracy, how well it works, it'll take a, an operator that's maybe not your best operator, but it makes him one of your best operators. Once they get to where they understand what they're doing with the equipment, it's very easy for them to read the screens. It's all there in front of them. They can see what it says for the machine to do. Yeah, you just go. I hook it up, set it up, they got their model, looking at their plans right in their face, so they just go. They have the files, they have it on their machine, they can keep going as they need to until the machine tells them to stop. You know, this thing puts a finish on stuff that you don't really have to go back and touch. We haven't used our motor grader that much. You yield your products better because you're on grade, because we did the dirt work with 3D, and you cut quite a bit of labor cost because of that. The new sensors that they have on it seem to be a lot quicker response. You'll notice that when it hits the pile, it doesn't move. It'll stay right on grade and keep going. There's not a lot of float in it. There's no float. The safety aspect has increased immensely. Now the guy doesn't have to mount an antenna or a cable every day on the blade. No one has to climb out on the front of the machine while the machine's running. Unless the operator, you know, go unsupervised as far as having someone sitting there having to check grade for them all day long. You know, you, you don't have them walking around, you're trying to clean off hubs and things like that, you know, and you're not getting in and out of the machine two dozen times. As an owner, you have to look at what you save, and we felt we saved labor, we saved cost. We found out we did work faster, and every owner has to look at that. Our owner absolutely believes in the technology. You know, for him, the investment translates into efficiency and more dollars. It's pretty amazing to put a system on a machine and have a operator that's been operating most of his life. It just makes his job so much easier, faster, more efficient. And you know, they'll get off the machine and shake your hand and say thank you for what you've done to our equipment and our company.